invited to a UNESCO seminar in Bergen in Norway. And there Coleman was discussing his work on equal opportunities. He has done very nice research on that topic. And that's what I decided I am going to do. So uh, when I was uh, back again, I decided to get my papers here. Center where they gave courses in mathematical decision making, which I also liked a lot, and it has played an important role in my further work. After all this, I thought it was about uh, I know enough to go to the States. <laughs> and if you look at it, I'm at the right side at the bottom. <laughs> <laughs> Well, so the social scientists at that time, they didn't pass this formula. <laughs> and this is a big mistake, because I thought, why not? Eh? Skip it. I also don't understand it. Let's go to the next page. <laughs> and in the next page, the, you can find models like this, which we have seen before, past models, and you can uh, read it very easily. Eh? If you went to the next pages, it was explained what he was doing, and you could understand it. So, even when I was in the States still, I was looking at this discussion which was going on in the Netherlands. And, well, the next step was that we thought, well, if we use the computer, we can also do better. We were all kept already using for this experiment all the time the computer. And, in fact, there was one person, and we needed an interview program, which could uh, be used in a situation which was changing. Because in the beginning, we did it on an Apple computer. Then it became Atari, then MSX, and finally MS-DOS, MS-DOS. Uh, do you remember? <laughs> Very strong interviewers. <laughs> <laughs> 